YouTube, good evening, good morning, wherever you are, what's up? Today I'm going to talk about the AVG toolbar. It's a toolbar that comes with certain programs that are being, um, you know, sponsored by AVG. And uh, it's a real sad thing because if you get it on your computer, your whole system will be messed up. And I, by accident, uh, installed it on my, uh, on my Windows 8.2 uh, system that I just created you know and I'm gonna show you how I got it uh, as you know power ISO is one of my favorite programs and if you install power ISO up here you can hit I agree you know and this is what you don't see this is like really sneaky you know, Power ISO installation wizard, Power ISO uh, recommends the installation of AVG blah de blah. But you don't really see that. Up here you just think it's the license agreement of Power ISO that you're reading here. But it's not. It's AVG in fact that you're installing. So if you hit next, you know, and you hit install, look what will happen. I'm installing spyware at this moment on my computer from AVG and I'm gonna show you how hard it is to remove and we're gonna remove it together looking at the details and you don't want to believe what it's doing to your system it's unbelievable how much junk this uh, this this uh, toolbar brings with it. Look at the first place at the installation of Power ISO. How long it's taking? It's taking like really long. You see, and up here uh, you will be like, oh my gosh, what do I have here? No, I don't want this. Prevent uh, and cancel, you know. But look what will happen. Close. And now we just infected our browser. You see? And you're like, no, no, no. So you close your browser. That's the right thing to do. Just close it. And then you want to go to settings and then to control panel and then you just want to go to programs and features right and then you see it here and you're like I want to remove it delete and then you say yes and as you see the installer stops and at a certain moment you cannot do anything and then you can only close the program in order to install the AVG bloody blah, blah you must be locked on as an administrator then you're like okay I must be locked on as an administrator but I thought I was locked on as administrator already so you go to your um, to your account wherever it is user accounts there yeah and make changes to my account in PC settings I didn't have to have to go here your account uh, I don't want to go there man I hate this here uh, change your account type Look, I'm an administrator, you see that? Administrator. But I cannot remove this thing and I'm stuck with it. And this is uh, Windows 8.1. I made it 8.2, but it's 8.1 in fact. And I think more people might get this problem, especially if you also use, um, how you call it, uh, Power ISO. So, you know, that's a bad thing. So how to remove this? Well, it's really hard to remove. It's really, really hard to remove. 
what you should do is download the program called Revo. Where is it? Oops. Oh no. Go away. It's Revo Uninstaller Pro. Yeah. You start up Revo. And then it's not that easy. You must take a look. And here you see AVG toolbar and you will be like quick uninstall. Well, I can show it to you, but it won't work. Because it's gonna call up the uninstaller of the program. You see? And then on installing, you see, bloody bloody blah, blah, and then you say yes. And then of course, you will get a warning telling you that you must be logged on as an administrator to do whatever you have to do. Well, I'm just gonna stop it, right? Close the program. So, this is nonsense. What you should do, yeah, I just did it already, so that's why I'm gonna show it to you. You do a force on install, and then you browse, and you go to the folder called Program Files, AVG, Safeguard. You go up there, yeah, and you select Vprot. And you hit next, and you hit next, and then you just wait, this will also get stuck, but don't worry about it, this one you can close. And then you say scan. And now it's gonna scan all the folders that it infected. Then you say select all and then delete. You say yes. You see, you also we also get the warning here, Vprot will not start anymore. Here you hit uh, select all and then delete. These are all the registry uh, keys and all the nonsense and now it's gone you see so that's how to uninstall um, uh, the AVG toolbar and I also want to say uh, if you're using AVG you know um, and you're gonna do a new reinstall of your computer please don't install AVG anymore um, go for Komodo internet security they have a free version and it runs great it also runs on windows 8.1 but you must do some modifications i have a video in the listings please check it out and see how you can let um, this wonderful virus scanner that does not come with spyware it does it does it does by the way uh, I, I have to show you that let me show you that real fast um, well it's not really spyware but it has a jig body and uh, a browser and I think you can turn that off and you can also set uh, the settings to connect through the server I would not do that you know I would also not do that I would just leave it like this and do your own thing it's a very good virus scanner it's free as you can see here bloody bloody blah it's all free and you can protect yourself you can uh, block programs from going on the internet uh, sandbox uh, advanced tasks desks it is uh, a wonderful virus uh, virus scanner that you can get for free you can also buy the more advanced uh, version but then uh, yeah it will cost you money and this is for free Anyway, thank you for watching people, this was my uh, little video about how to uh, remove this crazy toolbar and I think any other toolbar from your computer, I think this is also the way how to remove other programs from your computer, 
especially the scan uh, the normal uh, uninstallers they always leave a lot of rubbish on your computer and your computer gets slow and sometimes get messed up and then you need other programs to clean that again so you know in this case you can use a Revo uninstaller to do this a Revo uninstaller by the way is uh, free and I think you can use it for let's take a look at Revo uninstaller because some of you will be like what is Revo uninstaller and you see here my uh, my start page was set to um, to AVG. Only thing we have to do is set it back to you know um, restore to default and then google.com. So there we go. And then we say okay, and then we hit our home. So and when we close it and we open it again, it will not go to. Um, AVG bullshit nonsense uh, dot com it will go straight up to my Firefox crashed oops what happened with my Firefox no 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 don't include restart Firefox Let's take a look here. What's going on? No, just go home. Okay, we are home again. We're closing her to see if everything is okay. Open her again. Okay, it's fixed. Revo on Installer Pro. There you go. This is the site. Only get it from the site, you know, the main site. And uh, you can download it for free, but it's only free for 30 days. So, you know, after 30 days, you will have to pay. And, you know, at least this version will help you to clean up your computer and to you know get things all fixed and clean and all good again for you anyway people this was it uh, i hope you like this video if you like uh, hit it the thumbs up and if you think this information was useful leave me a comment or reply or give me your experience about AVG toolbar and tell me what you think about um, virus scanners that are selling themselves as toolbars. To my next video, bye.